Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, back to Scrap Mechanic Workshop Hunters, and today we're showing off some high-tech builds. Technology at its finest in Scrap Mechanic, which is peak technology for gaming right here. I honestly don't know what to spawn to represent it. I'm just looking through this massive list of <laughs> here, I got, I got, I got something. Um, oh, okay, okay. What, th what? This is called Loki Tech Sleipner by Loki Odinson. Oh, I thought you were actually gonna. Oh, I see. Okay. This, I thought you were it, actually just starting the creations right yeah, away. I thought you were gonna the, spot in something funny. We were gonna have some banter, some back no, and forth. Comedy. I mean, just, comedy's over overrated. We don't yeah, really need comedy. True. We don't need um, anymore. So this has a really high tech turning mechanism. You can see when it turns, it lifts up the front end. Really nice feature right there. Um. Wait. What? What is he even doing? <laughs> what is? Hold on. What is actually? Hold, I think it's just it's relatively normal turning, but there's some weird stuff under here because it has it has multiple put, speeds. Okay, it's got it's got yeah, like he put first the gear really far back so he could get yeah. like all these different speeds. But like okay, okay. So if I try to press W and S, nothing happens because I gotta actually press number one to turn the car on first, and then yeah, that makes sense. then it'll work as you can see. So this is oh, first gear. Oh, he's got brakes. Press one, it's brakes. Uh, no, see, oh yeah, so if I if I press S, it's brakes. You can see that the pistons will actually go out and press against the, or not yeah, press yeah, against they, the wheels, they, but they'll just stop them they, from they spinning. They stop a little gear thing there that's, yeah, that's cool. Yeah, but this is first gear, uh, which is kind of slow. So then if I press number two, it'll gear it up into second gear. So now and we go, turn on the we gas go faster. Engine. It's a hybrid car, yeah. it's a hybrid. Um, and then if I hold number two, Three, I can go back into first gear, but then also if I hold it longer, I can switch it to reverse. So now I'm pressing W to go backwards. It's still I don't like S is just break. I mean, yeah, it's kind of like a real car. I get it. Yeah, you know, it's yeah, right, I get it. We can switch okay. back into first gear, but that's not even the most high tech part about this. My favorite part is uh, it's this right here. Look at this. Look at this hood. hood. But look at the way nice it opens. Hood. It's a really nice. Yeah, it's a really nice high tech hood. It's pretty cool actually. Yeah, it is really cool. Best hood that's I've ever seen. Hood. But, uh, and there's one more button, which is obviously the, the trailer hinge in the back. It, uh, it comes up with, with a button press. Yeah, but. this would actually be a sweet hybrid car for survival. Yeah, he actually like said in the description that he built it for survival, so. Everyone knows more power under the, there we go. See, look at yeah. that. Yeah, see, right. we really need you to start embracing nuclear power, to be honest. Yeah, you, There you it, go. You know, it's just, uh, it's like it's the so much better. package. It's yeah, so it much better. It's so much better. Like, look, we're, ne we're never gonna run out of fuel. You know? I know, ever. Here, turn around for a sec. Just. Oh, just, it's so front turn. heavy now. <laughs> Gotta go in reverse. Getting used to the the gear shifting. Can I, can I, there we go. I, uh, I'm gonna start off with possibly the best creation of the whole episode. Oh. And by best, I mean worst. Okay. Oh, this oh. is by uh, the Pick Gamer 24. I think it was supposed to be the Epic Gamer 24, but they're missing mm. an E, so it's the Pick Gamer 24. It's called the High Rider, and uh, oh, no. I know what you're thinking. Standard wood blocks is always a good sign. But don't worry, it doesn't do at all what you think it would. So it drives, you know. Okay. And then if you press the one button, it 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 doesn't it doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. So I I propose a challenge. This is the best challenge in the world. Okay. Without actually looking at the controller settings only flip the bearings and see who can get it to stand up straight first okay all right i got it i got it okay i got trust it trust me the controller settings are terrible it. this is you're, you're oh, already doing oh, it okay, i got okay, it okay, hold on. i got it gonna, okay, i got it good. i got it good. i got it okay and press the button okay that did not work as easy as i, I thought these, it was going okay, I think to all work these ones are bad uh uh Okay, that, that, oh, that. No, that one's, that uh, one's the that, wrong direction. That, this that. is so hard to do. No. Okay, that okay this is harder than I thought it was going to be. That one's bad. Now it's... Yeah, I'm just doing, right, like, I'm trying on. to do, like, one leg at a time, There we you know? go. I feel like that's the solution. Okay. And then this right. one. That one looks okay, good. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. And what was it? That, that one's... That? that one's... Okay, those ones are that good. That one's bad. Okay, that I don't know bad. what I'm doing. Is that one... Good. That one's bad, too? This one's bad? Is that one good? That one looks bad. Nope, that one was good. Now it's bad. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I'm good there. Okay, so okay. that one. This is so stupid. This, this is stupid very, job. very stupid. But it's actually. It could have been done so much intense. easier. Trust me. There's so many like negatives in the controller that didn't need to be there uh, that could have been made positive. Okay, that one, that one, and... that one. Oh no, okay, let's okay. get back to normal, please. Get back to normal. Okay, okay, that's that's good. I think okay. it's just this one left. 
No, no, no. That no, no, bad. no. That one's bad. No, no, no. This one, this that one. One's bad. That I did it. Bad. I did it. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I did it. I did it too. <laughs> we were like so close. <laughs> that was the actual was... like tie. I, I can't believe that. That oh, was so close. <laughs> For the next piece of high tech, I have Unnamed by Icy Jaden. Uh, it, okay. I guess this is the second creation of Tech Trash, he calls this series. And okay, here it is. This is this is your tech trash. You can have that one. I'm gonna have this one. That bad. Yeah. Uh, I don't know why he calls it tech trash. There's a switch in the this, front to open up the cockpits. This reminds me of that car uh, from The Simpsons when they had that episode <laughs> where it was like the car of the future, and it was like the bubble in the back for your children, and then the, oh, yeah. the seat in the front. You know what I mean? Kind of what this looks like. The wheels are in interesting positions. Yeah. So it gets better after you press number two. Um, because then it enters kind of like lightweight mode, but then yeah, you can okay. get even better if you hold number three, you could just fly. Oh, you just fought up fly. Yep, I feel like this is the car of the future that they imagined back in like the 70s. You know, I what if, what if humans got cars wrong, right? And instead of putting four wheels with like two in the front, two in the back, we oh. were supposed to put four wheels in a diamond for me. Yeah, you know? like what this. What if we were like just like wrong this, the yeah. whole time? I mean, to be honest, why not five? Five wheels. Well, I feel like five is just just odd numbers are silly. Nobody likes odd numbers. Hey, Everybody likes even numbers. Nothing bad ever happened with a three-wheeled car. They're all super reliable oh, yeah, no, and consistent. Sure. They're I definitely mean, not banned in a, in a bunch of different places. I don't know what you're talking about. They're reasons. reliable. They're so reliable. I'm pretty sure one of them even has the word reliant in its name. Right, and you know what? And that's like, that's just one less wheel to take care of, you know? So that's just, it's just that's cheaper true. for everybody. Well, no, you see, you want to do five wheels because then if you lose one, you still have, oh, you have a bunch of backups. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, that, that makes sense. Yeah, makes you sense. don't, five you, wheels. yeah, you only have to replace your wheels after two of them get flat. What if we just do one wheel, but it's made of like steel or something really hard so mm. that it, you know, it doesn't wear out. You know what I mean? I feel yeah. like we're onto something here. We should patent this. It steel this would not technique. wear out grinding against gravel well let's make a diamond wheel a single wheel made out of diamond mm. that just drives around yeah right? yeah it won't wear out you you buy it once and then you're done for all of all of your life you know you just have this one diamond wheel you pass it on to your kids mm -hmm. generation to generation you know inherit grandpa's da diamond wheel yeah you know? this is how we make cars more affordable you only need to buy one wheel made of diamond forever and, yeah. for like five generations i you know. know yeah super affordable yeah. I don't know why no one's thought of this yet. I mean, wh why would you? Why not spend twenty million dollars once uh, instead of right. spending, you know, fifty dollars like ten times? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. The math just works out. This was something that it looks very underwhelming, but then it actually is really awesome when you when you think about it. This is called Small Tech Turret by Tomatsu, and it looks underwhelming. Okay. Uh huh. It just it just looks like a turret. You can you can try that one and you okay. can shoot it. It's all it's all vanilla by the way, but it's got like a ton of glitch welded stuff going on inside. Uh huh. And if you look when you turn it, yeah, no, yeah, don't, we got a don't, little uh, viewfinder. That's pretty cool. Don't don't do that. But <laughs> oh. Uh, <laughs> but if you look, okay, so you look when you, turn, you press one first of all, it Whoa. just has a lot of guns. If you press Whoa. two, but here's a crazy thing. Like look at how responsive it is, and then try and figure out how he's actually controlling it. Cause like look at the bearings. The bearings are controllers. Wait, They're all like okay. controllers. They are control. Whoa, they are controllers. Is this vanilla? Right, but it's so sensitive. Is this vanilla? Yeah, it's vanilla. It's all just like glitch welded together somehow. But then look at look at like the steering. The steering controls like a something. But then like there's controller bearings, which I just I'm so confused by these controller bearings. There's a piston. Yeah, but it's, it's it's all like glitched into each other, it so is. I don't understand. I think. Oh, it rotates the sensor. What? It does rotate the sensor. But the, and the sensor's detecting... But how does that translate to... Dude, this stuff is so big Wait, so brain, this it's sensor... unbelievable. I was just... It was, one of, it was one of those creations that I just saw it, and I was, like, blown away by how cool it looks. Can I... No, that doesn't... What? Are you hooking it up to something? What does this do? Uh, maybe, I think you're aiming too high. For the next piece of high tech here, I have, I actually really, really like this thing. This is by Scrapcat6, and this is called Scrapcat High Tech Front Loader. And this is like, this is not only is it high tech, but this is like scrap tech. This is, you know, like survival scrap pieces front loader. So yeah, check this oh, thing out. I, I already like the cockpit. I'm yeah, a big fan. get in there and watch how oh, this and thing the side works. Pieces? Yeah, what? so good, isn't it? All right, press it some looks buttons. Like a tank. Press some Dude, buttons. One, one lifts. 
lifts that up? Yeah, hold, hold it do? down. There oh, you I go. See. Look at that. Is that cool or what? That's that's really cool. Two extends it forward. Uh -huh. Okay. Three does. Oh, tips your bucket. Yep. Pretty high. I like how you use pistons technology. instead of just bearings. I like I like the pistons. Yeah, pistons look super cool. But I just I love the scrappy nature of like all the pieces that he chose. Yeah, it looks really good. Yo, load up some. Put some stuff down. Put some. Put some all things right. down. No, all not right. that. Like, put it on the ground. I'm, you got. Oh, I gotta pick it up off the oh, ground. Okay. It's a loader. Oh, okay. This isn't a put stuff in the bucket machine. Okay. I need more. I need more engine power. Come uh, on. Uh, Come on. Oh, get it. you get got it. it. There we you go. Got yeah. It. Yeah. All yeah. Right. Where do we? Yeah, where you, are we you gotta. This? You gotta load it right. You gotta drop it off right here. You gotta unload oh, it. Okay. Okay. We're going. We're gonna we're gonna do it. Yeah. All right. Drop it from. Oh, you got it. This is mechanic launcher by Al Ooh. Alutrel Tech by Alutrel. I'm a mechanic. Um, I'm a mechanic. Yeah, it's, a, it's it's a mechanic launcher. So you gotta weld it. I'm ready. I'm, right. re I'm so ready Fire. for this. Fire! You gotta press your switch. Oh. We. You actually up in the tree. What? Yeah, I hit the tree. I went inside the trunk of the tree for like a Let's solid go. second and then got launched out and now I'm in the water. All right, we're ramping up to some pretty high tech stuff. Um, this one is, uh, this one's called Inferno by Alutral Tech. And this is just okay. a high tech car. It, uh, oh, the door, the door actually worked this time. Here, I'll get the passenger seat. I'll let you All try right. it out. Oh, no, I don't want to drive. I don't want to drive. <laughs> okay. Driving is All too right. much effort. I All just right. want to, I want to chill. Uh, so I think you gotta, enjoy. there you go. Look at oh, those the doors. Oh, the whole front windshield moves too. Did yeah, you it that? does. It's to accommodate oh, it the door. Oh, just Yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah. It's on purpose. Um, so this thing's pretty fast. Oh boy, hold on. Let's not go into the ditch. It's got rear wheel steering, which I thought was an interesting choice. Um, oh it boy. kind of looks like a Lamborghini, but not. Also, yeah. I'm kind of curious. The, the the wing on the back is like an active wing. Like, look, it goes up and down. Oh yeah, it um, does. On bearings, but I think there's no reason for that because it's not yeah. like wings mod. So oh boy, just, this thing's lagging. Hold on. It's hold is it on. jammed in itself. Uh, yeah, I think it's jammed in itself, and I'm jammed in it. All right, this, this you has... know the first person view looks pretty good though. Oh, I didn't even I try say. that. Oh, it does, doesn't it? But this is, I haven't even shown you its like final that. form. You're gonna want to go into third person for this. Okay, uh, yeah. So you press number three and you get hidden spud guns. Yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah, hidden spud guns. They, okay. They, they they hide back in the thing. Okay. High tech spud guns. High tech. That's that's high tech. High tech yeah. hidden spud. You should be more impressed. Oh wow! Yeah, Whoa, bro. high tech. Hit his foot. Whoa! Didn't see that coming. Whoa. High Didn't tech. See spot. Whoa. James Bond. This is the highest tech. It's called Tech Scout by Cookie King. Uh, this is gonna be the shortest creation we show on today's episode, both literally uh, and figuratively. Oh, Here we no. go. That's what it does. Oh no. That's it. There's no controlling it. It has oh, a mind no. of its own. That it. That's all it. That's all it does. Dare you stand in front of it? Ah! Just, no, no, wait. no, come back, come back. The tech, the tech machine is gonna, I'm just gonna spit it. Here, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Look what it, it did to the vehicle. doesn't even break all the parts. Look at what it did to the <laughs> We're fine, I'm fine. We're nothing fine. bad, yeah, nothing happened. Going. Everything, just pretend like everything's normal. It, it, That's great. I just have an invisible car, mostly. All right, Kyle, we're getting into the highest of tech right now. This is by uh, XXXX. Na name not found. Um, oh, perfect. Yeah. This is high tech motor. So check this out. Um, check this thing out. Um, you can tell it's high tech by the uh, automatically engaging thrusters. So. Uh, oh, it's got a speedometer. That's yeah, cool. Yeah, it's got a speedometer so in, you can see how real fast units, dude, you're not even tucking. Not in those fake freedom units. It's got real units. Yeah. Like that, kilometers an yeah. hour. Yeah. Uh, so there's buttons. They do things. So number one's the horn, uh, obviously. Number yeah, two, I, I'm I'm having problems just driving. <laughs> Don't drive. Stop driving. That's your first problem. Just stop driving. Okay. What does number two do? Oh, it raises. Yeah. Number it. number two raises your ground clearance. You know, just in case. Uh, number three, th three is a forward boost. Yeah. That. That's, yeah. Okay. That's not necessary. And four is lasers. Laser guns. 
Do they actually do damage? And then five is the fun one. So just press number five and don't press anything else. Ready? I, I, I did. Is anything happening? No, I was just like freaking out. For me, uh, I think if I press five, it'll bring us together. There we go. I press number five. I'm on my way. I don't even have uh, to do anything. Just, mine's actually just freaking out. Oh, I, hey, I don't even. Here, here we go. It's the. How, uh, how are you? Number five. You... Number five is the con finder button. <laughs> Apparently. Here, um, here, watch. Try, try to go as far away from me as you can. Ready? Go ahead. All right, here we yeah, go. There we go. There we go. I'm coming after you. I'm coming after are you, you. Are you though? I'm, oh, no, I'm actually fly. kind of can... flying. I, it actually feels really natural right now. <laughs> Oh no, it's flying up! How is it flying up? I told oh, no. you it's high tech! Run! This oh way. no, gravity! Good. Very, okay, good, good, good. I don't, have, I don't have thruster assistance for gravity. Oh no, I'm stuck in a wall. Hold on, hold on. Okay, I can, hold on, hold there on. There we go. I'll just go. boost I'll myself the, out of here. There we yeah, go. I'll stay, on the, I'll stay on the wall here. Here we go. I'll stay there, down on the there ground. There we go. I'll skim the ground. Where are you? There you are. I'm skimming the ground. You can't right. catch me. Oh, I'll catch you. I'll catch nope. you. I'm, I'm staying down. I'm coming after you. No, no, you can't catch me. Oh no, you went around oh the God. corner. <laughs> this is terrifying. All right, uh, let's see if you can do it. Oh, there he comes, there he comes, there he's... I'm coming after you. No, oh, he's so fast. Oh man, it's when I hit right, objects will, and stuff. This walk will protect me. The there walk, we go, look the at walk. that. The walk, the walk. Oh no, oh no, he goes so fast. He turns, he changes direction so quickly. There we go. All right, oh perfect. boy. This is really cool. It's by Sponster. It's called Highly Mobile. Oh, hi I can't talk to <laughs> you. Highly Mobile Car. Highly Jeez. Mobile. Highly Mobile. How mobile car. is this? Oh, interesting. I'm just gonna sit here. All right. So you can press the buttons and see what it does. Oh, okay. So just goes forward. Yeah, it drives. Mobile high, car stop. Highly Mobile. All right. Highly Mobile. Yeah. Wait a minute. And What's with this? Okay. Press, interesting press steering. All right. Number one. Yeah. Now, now drive. Now try driving. Uh, you, gotta, you gotta turn. Oh, like, it's okay. Like we got a strafe. Steering. Yeah, we got a strafe yeah. mode, kinda. All right. Yep. Do I press number two? Yeah, I press two. Do I unpress number one or keep it pressed? Yeah, I, I unpress them. Two is like, look at this. It's tank steering oh. now. Oh, interesting. That is actually That's pretty, pretty cool. cool. And I'm just realizing right? how cool this vehicle actually looks. Like the actual yeah, it looks the body of cool. it's actually pretty awesome. All right. And then press uh, the Number last three. one, and, and look at that. Then you get these angle wheels, and now you can actually drive like two. Oh. Right. And when Why? you turn, it like, I don't know, but like when you turn, it uses tank steering. It actually, it can actually turn and stuff. This is so weird. It's kind right? of like a sideways strafe, but also a little bit of a turn. It reminded me of those forklifts that have like the unidirectional wheels on them that can like yeah. go in any, you know what I mean, any direction. Oh, look at that! This look vehicle that. drives. This is this is a very mobile vehicle. All you right. know what's crazy about this thing too? It's made of so much metal. Three, check this out. You can even look at this. Look at how much of it's gonna actually. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> All right, we're working our way up in the tech here. Uh, this is by Capricornus Craft, and this is called High Tech Car. Yeah, look at this thing. Look at this bad boy. Uh, look, at this, look at this bad boy. Uh, look at this bad yeah, boy. Yeah, that's yeah, that mm -hmm, yeah, it's a yeah. car. There's a bunch of passenger seats. You can uh, you can hop in. Oh, oh yeah, I'm sure. where where are they? Right are next they to the me. ones that are up in up in the air. Take, there, take out your they... connect tool and uh, you just hop in a green thing. There we go. Oh, uh, we left we left some parts behind because uh, <laughs> you can't put it on a lift. I forgot about that. If you put it on a lift, some parts fall out. <laughs> oh, perfect. Yeah. Well, right well, now we the go. whole back end of the car is underground. All on right. My screen. There we go. So what's ha I'll tell you what's happening on my screen. So uh, I can drive normally. It looks like a Tron car. Lots of LEDs and circular wheel yeah, I remember, things. I remember this scene from Tron. This is yep. that scene where he uh, did the thing with the car. But if I press number two, my wheels turn at like a 45 degree angle inwards and I can like super hover on the ground, which actually feels super nice. As you can probably tell by how fast we're traveling across the map. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. This is just a wonderful experience. Yeah, good old multiplayer, woo! All right, I'll go ahead and head back down on the ground now. I have a thing called a high tech, uh, high tech house or house high tech by Ivan number one. House tech. I'm around. Now I know what you're gonna say. 
Hey, and, look at this uh, Yes, car. that is a hover car in the driveway. Ooh, this is a nice looking hover car. Right? And I was like, wow, I'm going to take the hover car out for a spin. But if you remove it, it's still welded to the ground. Oh, no. Here, I have a feeling the hover just, car might We could just delete the ground. We could just delete the ground. There we go. Oh, there you go. Does it hover? There it we go. Oh, oh okay. Nice. I don't, it's a little it bit more flies. than a hover car. All right, look there at this. There you go. Look at this. This is That's actually kind of right. nice. This is actually kind of nice. All right, there's there's other buttons. Anyway, I'm not sure if he made the hover car or not. It felt very much like he might have taken someone else's hover car and welded Here, it. Yeah, I'll just the park thing. There we go. Yeah, All right, nice so and park. Check out, of course, my pool. This is uh, oh. my high tech. My, uh, it must be cold. Clean. Uh, <laughs> now I'm, in, oh, now I'm wow. in the water. Yeah, here oh, yeah. I, I want to take a swim too. Oh yeah, feels oh, nice. Yeah. Feels is... nice. You know, I have a pool at my house, but it's definitely not this shape. It's <laughs> very different shape. Also, how do you get your car out of the drive? Oh, I guess you hover it. Oh, it's a hover right. car, con. You, yeah, come on, sense. think I'm about an idiot, it. Think about course. it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so welcome to the house. This is uh, the house. Okay. Uh, we've got, of course, the power room. Uh, very important mm. to have have your power. It all comes from that box in your bathroom. house. Bathroom, okay. We got a nice, nice bathroom. bathroom. We got lights everywhere. We got the, the very fancy kitchen. Uh huh. I like how there's actually a door um, to lock yourself in the kitchen. Yeah, well, you can. Very, course, very interesting. You... Does your kitchen have a door to close to close out everybody? No, else? my kitchen's like open to our living room yeah. and our hallway. I think so it's most like... kitchens. And actually, our kitchen's open to three rooms. It's like literally a walkway. Yeah, that... Like you walk through the kitchen to go places. Yeah, so. that's kind of the, the basics of house design is you want easy access to the kitchen. So when you're carrying yeah, all your food, this is, you don't this gotta is the open high -tech a door. Room, dude. Oh, look at this! Look at oh. this! This is the couch. You got your big screen TV like way on okay, the other but, side of the room. But but wall shark. Yeah, wall shark. Yeah, that's that's true. Wall shark. Um, also, check this out. I don't know what this does, but yeah, that high tech button. That's right, high tech act, button. That's how you and then, and then the your tech. high tech bedroom. Now you'll notice there was a door on the kitchen, but there's no door on the bedroom. Um, <laughs> Makes sense. And Makes there's a sense. glass door to the outside of the bedroom. Uh huh. To the the high tech patio. Well, don't shoot up the place, man. Please show up and just shoot up the house. Okay, well, that's, that's, that's great. That's great. Um, but yeah, anyway, high tech. You know, I thought it was cool. It looks all right. It's a nice house. What are you doing? Um. All right, Con, I got one more, and I saved the best for last, and I do not have a lot of hopes for how multiplayer is going to handle this for you, but uh, this is by DDL126, and this is called High Tech Stable Hover 2.3. So here, before I take it off the lift, I'll let you observe. I mean, it looks it looks all right. Yeah, here. it's on the lift. Why don't you get in the seat while you still know where it is? Is the pass? Is there multiple seats? There's two seats. There... There's two seats. There you go. I mean, it looks it looks okay. Okay, all right. All right I'm in the uh, passenger seat. How's it looking now? Looks fine. Really? I'm impre okay. Yeah. Well, we'll see what happens when I activate it. You ready to see this thing hover? Yeah, I'm I'm excited. All right, here it goes. That looks, that looks okay. Here it goes. Move it. Oh, yeah. it, does, it, uh, it does some weird. It, you know what? It's not I bad. I think it's this like is what you're tilting seeing. Tilting the engines back and forth yes. really quick. Yes. The pistons are going up and down with the sensors on them, detecting the ground. And then that determines what the thrusters do if they're going to have more downforce or more sideways force to lift it up and down. So I think you you're know, actually I, I seeing it. it accurately. Yeah, it looks like it's, it's freaking you know. out to me, too. But this is how it works. Here, we'll even go over some uneven terrain, which, as we know, uh, hovercrafts tend to not like very much. But look at that. It goes right yeah, up over Yeah, I will say it. with hovercraft and scrap mechanic, having, like, your pistons, uh, not your pistons, your thrusters on, like, suspension or, like, moving bearings or something seems to be the way to make the most stable one. Yeah. Uh, in vanilla, anyway. You could make it with, like, mods and crazy controls and stuff. But in vanilla, because you can't change the thrust level of your, your thrusters, like, you're always at the same level, this actually kind of helps deal with that. This is really cool. Yeah, and what's Why cool about it... Why is there down it, thrust? Uh... Uh, I think it's keeping us from going too high, like bouncing up too high and getting out of control. Oh, there's like two pistons, two sensors yeah. on each one. But oh, actually, I, I think the two sensors are for a different reason. It has varying strengths. The closer you get to the ground, the more thrusters it activates. So it'll keep you from uh, hitting the ground too hard. Like watch, if I go up into here and bounce, you'll see those extra thrusters on the outside activate if I get close to the ground. Right. And that, that kind of helps. Cool. That kind of helps you prevent from uh, hitting the ground too hard if your thrusters aren't strong enough. Yeah, like this it. is a really, I mean, this would be a very expensive survival build, but look how easy 
it is to navigate, even you over know, uneven terrain and stuff. I'm so disappointed in survival <laughs> with the fuel cost of thrusters because <laughs> hovercraft are just, you can't like, make them. You just can't. Yeah, hovercrafts are definitely not a survival vehicle. I mean, I mean so when you think it, about it, though, cool. the word survival is kind of like you don't really go. You don't really get the uh, the luxuries when you're thinking no, about you survival. Really yeah, yeah survival is no. more about the essentials. And I broke. Uh, my I broke a thruster. Is on a piston. Did you see that? It is. Oh, yeah, it's so on it a piston. is. Oh yeah. It's I can activate yeah. it by activating. You can activate my, my seat. For Why? Some why? I don't know. It's, it's, it's essential yeah, for it's, me to see over. Yeah, it's uh, that actually might be. Yeah, that might be it. All right. Well, now that we've seen what uh, the future entails, I think we're ready yep. to prepare. Yeah, let us know in the comments down below if you have uh, other ideas for workshop hunters. Yep. And we'll see you guys and, uh, in the next video. Bye. Bye.